Hey guys, it is once again time for my annual video of the Christmas tree, uh, the snow village, and the train uh, setup. Uh, we do this around our tree every year. It's been sort of a tradition for us, and uh, this is just kind of a video I make every year. It's one of my favorite videos to make. Um, I think tied almost with our outdoor light uh, video tour video, which I do, and I already did, uh, which you can watch if you haven't already. Uh, I would recommend watching that one first. Um, but this is the uh, Christmas tree l setup or layout that we have this year. Um, our tree, we always get a real tree every year. Um, the sad thing is the place that we usually get our tree from does not sell trees anymore. It's like a nursery. Uh, it's kind of it's 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 kind of hidden away. It's very hard to find. They used to sell Christmas trees every year we got them and then the past 2 years they haven't. We thought last year maybe they just like ran out or forgot to order them but they didn't they didn't have them this year. So uh yeah, we just got got it from another farm, another lot. Um we got C7 lights. <clears throat> we have bubble lights. There's a few bubble lights mixed in with the C7 lights. Oh, that one's not bubbling. There we go, that's better. Um, some ceramics, ceramic ones, and some uh, transparent ones. And then mini lights as well. We have some regular white mini lights as well as twinkling mini lights, as you can see. We have two sets of twinkling mini lights. Um, so that's the tree. Now the uh, train itself, as you guys all know, this is our little tradition again, the New Bright Holiday Express animated train set, model 380, the 1997 or 1998, I can never remember because the box says it differently, is different from the actual cars, the train cars themselves, um, 1997, 1998 limited edition version. Um, that was given to me by my grandfather, and I always go over each year. My grandfather gave me the original set, which consists of the engine tender, uh, the candy dancer car, and the caboose. And he also gave me this one, the post office car. Um, and then the other cars, I, I got these two from uh, some lady who was selling a complete set, and I bought these cars from her. And then my parents gave me the bakery car for Christmas a few years ago. Um, and that was the last car that I needed to complete the 380 series. Um, I still need the passenger car and the station. Um, so I'm looking for those still as kind of accessories. Um, this year, you will notice when I turn the train on that it will run a lot faster than it has in the past couple of years. That's because last night when I went to turn it on or went to start it up, because uh, it was over there, I had to move it back. It, uh, the engine started making this awful squealing noise. So I took it apart. I oiled the actual bearings in the, like the bearings that the gears ride on and the bearings that the, um, in the motor itself. And, um, that not only quieted it down, but it also made it run a lot faster, just like it used to. Um, so I'm very happy with that actually. Um, yeah, so it no longer, it runs all sluggish. Uh, like you've seen it in the past couple of years and it featured in the past few videos that I've made. It ran a little slower, so it'll run a lot better now. Um, but anyway, the snow village itself, this year we kind of situated it in the front here. It's like front and center. Um, we put our little uh, nativity scene to the left there. Um, but I've got all the usual, um, the visit with Santa Pavilion the inn, the little Christmas trees, that one which has the little ornaments on her there. I think, I don't know if they're ornaments or berries. Um, and then the rest of them are just plain trees. And then we've got the little lighted fence with the garland and the LEDs, which looks very nice. I just put some new batteries in it so it's nice and bright. The lamp posts, the four lighted ones, which uh, still have the batteries in them from last year and they're still working nice and bright. And then we've got some figurines 
and then our North Pole Post Office, which is way smaller than our other figurines here, and the giant deer, salt and pepper shakers. Uh, yeah, I think it looks really cute. Um, just a very nice little winter scene. And then, oh, the North Pole guys back there. Um, yeah, so, oh, and then we put the, I put the little church ornament back there kind of in the background. I had it on top of the Santa pavilion, like on that edge there, but I guess it fell. But uh, I think it looks really nice. So I'm going to turn the train on. I'm going to start it up, and I'm going to first run the train with the lights on these lights, and then I'll turn the lights off and I'll show it to you in the dark. So first, I notice that the train is muted for some reason, so let's unmute it. So let's start it up. Notice just how much more faster it's going.
I'm gonna stop it now. Still works. I really am in the market for some new track for this set because this track, the curve, curved pieces, I know for a fact are part of the original set. And then there's, I think, four straight pieces that are part of the original set. And then each extra add-on car came with two extra pieces of track. And the original, especially the original pieces, are just, this isn't a good example because these are actually still in okay condition, but that one's coming apart. Uh, this one I had to, I had a, a twist tie a bunch of them together. That one you can see it's missing a part of the plastic on the side there. Um, so yeah, they're, they're all a mess. Um, they still make good contact though, so that's that's a good thing, that they still work, the, the, the rails. Um, but yeah, I definitely am, within the next couple of years, I feel like I'm going to need new track because this track is just on its last legs. But the train itself, thankfully, still works fine. It's in great condition, despite being heavily played with over the years. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, all of these little people. So... I think that just about does it for this video. So that is the the Christmas tree uh, display with the snow village and the train layout. Uh, thank you guys for watching, as always, and I will see you in the next video. And have a very happy holidays.